Do you know how to wear a lace front? Do you know how to cut your lace and glue it down and make it look natural and do all the other cool stuff you see the beauty gurus do? If not, guess what? I don't either. <laughs> and that is why you should continue watching this video so maybe we can learn something together, okay? <laughs> Hey guys, it's me, Navi, and welcome back to my channel. And of course, if you're new here, welcome, baby. I'm very glad you're here. And on today's edition of Navi's Bootleg Hair Tutorial. Hair tutorials. Eunice has partnered up with me yet again, surprisingly, and they have sent me another lovely wig for me to review for you guys today. And it just so happens to be a lace front wig. Now, if you've been watching this series long enough, then you know that I've reviewed just about every kind of wig there is in the book. But never have I did a lace front, and the reason why is because I don't wear I don't wear lace fronts. I, have y'all noticed that if you've seen me wearing a wig, it's either a headband wig or just a regular wig. I never worn a lace front, ever. Doing the whole cutting the lace and then gluing it down and cutting the wig and just trying to make it look like it's your real hair and not look like you've come straight out of a crack house gives me straight anxiety because I have a feeling that somebody somewhere somehow is gonna notice from a distance that the shit's fake and it looks tacky and then it's gonna give me like secondhand embarrassment and I'm gonna have to go home and cry and ah! But at the same time, your girl is always open to trying new things. And today's video, we're gonna be trying to install a lace front wig. And of course, before we get started, if you guys could do me a huge, huge favor, if you could please like this video, subscribe to my channel, and of course, watch to the end of this video. Seriously, watch to the very end because I have no idea how this is gonna turn out. So um, I'm about as clueless as you are right now. Let's see what we're working with today. If I can get the box open, that'd be pretty great. <laughs> Oh, oh, it's taped, okay. So this is what the wig looks like, the one that I chose to review. So not only will we be trying a lace front, we're gonna be trying red. I'm gonna be girl in red today. You will be my girl, my girl, my girl, my girl. Sorry. Comment down below if you listen to Girl in Red because honestly, same. So this is the burgundy straight, 16 inches. So it's not exactly like a deep, deep red, like like vivid, bright red. It's more of a like dark reddish color. You can see what I'm talking about. And then it also came with a headband, which is so freaking cute. Oh, it's Christmassy, even better. Out of season, but that's okay too. <laughs> and of course, the wig caps, which I'm pretty sure every wig comes with. I already slicked my hair back, saved time, patience, and energy. So I'm just gonna go ahead and slap the cap on. And then once I do that, I can immediately get to installing my lace. So we got our lucky cap on. And now we're just gonna get to installing the wig. Why don't we? Oh, this is a pretty shade of red. Y'all look it. Like it looks like a wine red, don't you think? What should we call it? What do we call it? Y'all, what are we naming my wig today? She's cute. She's a vibe. It does come with clips on the sides, actually. If I don't drop it. So there's a clip here and then a clip in the back and then a clip on the other side, of course, right there. This is how much lace up front they give you to work with which isn't that much, but frankly, I think that's good because the more lace there is, the more anxiety. And we don't like anxiety on this channel. We typically tend to take anxiety and kick it out the door. That is not the door, that is the shower. I'm just gonna go ahead and put this on my head. Whoa, whoa. tell y'all I don't know what I'm doing. It's a good wig, it is. It's just me, I don't know what I'm doing. And before you ask, yes, I have watched the tutorials. That doesn't help the fact that I don't know what I'm doing. Well, there's one thing I can do. I can knock out the packaging wrinkles by combing it out, that'd be great. I apologize to anyone that came to this video hoping to get a legit lace front tutorial. I'm so sorry. <laughs> 
But let's talk about the hair though. Like, do you see the movement? Do you see the fluidity? <laughs> What am I supposed to do next? Oh yeah, I'm supposed to cut the lace, shit. <laughs> so uh, we gonna go ahead and cut this little lace part now. Oh my God. <laughs> actually see what I'm doing so I don't mess this up or even worse than I already have. I think I took out some hair. Okay. It could be worse, Navi. It could be worse. It could be worse. It could be so, so much worse. Let's just pray that I don't cut off my edges. So close to my edges. Okay, I cut it off. I'm assuming that this is where the glue part would come in, where you would glue it down in the front, but guess what? I don't own any glue. Maybe that's what the headband is for. Oh yeah, we definitely gotta cover the front because this is not gonna work. This is not gonna work. <laughs> Headbands to the rescue. You can never go wrong with a headband. Okay. Okay. Okay, it's a little satin scarf. We love satin. Satin is very great. So yeah, a little satin Christmas scarf never hurt anyone. Am I probably gonna look like somebody out of the 70s? Yes. That is okay because apparently people are bringing the 70s and the 80s back, so that is technically a good thing. Oh my God, this is way too far back. This is way too far back. It's okay. It's okay, we can make this work. I am determined to make this work. All right, so this time we're gonna try again, but with this headband, it's one of my own. Uh-oh, uh, okay, okay. Wait just a minute now, hold on, Nancy. Maybe I can bring it down a little more in the front. Just gotta bring it down a little more in the front, it's no big deal. Channeling my inner Aaliyah. Okay, see, this could work, this could work. This could work, this could work. Now I get rid of some of these packaging wrinkles and we'll be good to go. It's me, Jesse and Ari. If we, if they test me, they sorry. Ride us up like a hurry and pull up in this Ferrari. Wow. If there is anything that this video has taught me, it is that there is nothing that some sunglasses and a bandana can't not fix. This is a look now, whether you like it or not. Hope we're digging the vibes, cause this is gonna be my look for today. This idea was either a hit or miss. And the first time I tried it, it was a miss. But this time, oh, this time, this was a hit. This was a hit, okay? Okay, okay, I hope you're enjoying this. I hope you're taking a picture. Take a picture so you can show your friends. I'm one of the cool cats. Thank you so much once again to Eunice for sending me this wig. If you wish to buy it as well, I will put the link to this, the link to the description, really. I will put the link to it in my description box down below so you can buy it as well. And of course, thank you guys so much for watching to the end of this video. I know this was probably hard to watch. If you're a beauty guru, I, I apologize. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I tried, okay, I tried. And I succeeded, I succeeded. If you liked it, please let me know by leaving a comment, liking this video. Wait, that was out of order. Liking this video, leaving a comment, and of course, subscribing to my channel. And of course, don't forget to check out some of my other videos. I will see you guys next time with another video with this look, maybe, who knows, maybe, maybe not. Have a great morning, such afternoon, such evening, such whatever time you watch this, and I thank you for doing so. And yeah, bye-bye.